everybody, welcome back to the Kid Friendly Video Channel and thanks to each and one of every one of you for making this the most popular video we ever made on our channel, Kid Friendly Videos. This is Fabulous Miss Fritter. We made it from Miss Fritter, the bus, the school bus of doom. And it has received so far over 15,000 views and uh, thank you very much. Uh, thanks for sharing it, thanks for liking it, thanks for sending comments. In our collection of fabulous cars, we have Fabulous Mater and we have Fabulous Jackson Storm with red wheels. We have fabulous cruiser mirrors with silver wheels. We're going to do that in red someday soon, don't worry. And we have fabulous Lightning McQueen. It's in the wrong color. We know that. We're going to paint that up someday. And I think you'll notice, actually, this is fabulous Dusty from the Plains movie. It's in the wrong color, too, but that's okay. And uh, people have been sending me ideas and suggestions. And one person said, why don't I make the Planet Pizza Delivery Truck? It's in every movie. You only see it for a second in Cars 3 in the Demolition Derby. And we talked about that, my son and I, and he said, maybe you can make it out of Fillmore. And I said, Fillmore? Not even close. This is actually Arby now. So then he said, how about Mater? And I said, you know what? I can make the Planet Pizza delivery truck out of Mater. No problem at all. What I'm going to do, folks, I'm going to cut this here tall cage off, cut his mirrors off, fill this with Play-Doh, cover that up with Play-Doh, and build a box on the back with, with out of white play-doh and i'll make the planet pizza delivery truck so the first thing we're going to do if actually this, if this is the first time you're here what we're doing is we're taking cars from pixar cars and we're turning them into other cars like for example here's santa mcqueen it's actually lightning mcqueen turned into santa and there's mrs claus lightning mcqueen's wife and we have all kinds of zebra cars here there's zebra mater zebra so miles axelrod zebra the king and over here we got a bunch of the crazy 8th Demolition Derby cars, such as Sig Alert, made from Ramon, Push Up, I mean Push, push Over, made from Nicholas, and there's one, I just knocked off one of his exhaust pipes, that is Liability, made from Ramon, <clears throat> and here we have Fair Game, the taxi, number 42, made out of Mustang Burger, and behind Miss Fritter, you're going to see a whole bunch of other cars, look, there's Chimichanga, made from, you say it? Yes, Finn McMissile. And this is actually Lightning McQueen turned into Jackson Storm. And somewhere else on this table we have, this is actually Jackson Storm turned into Next Gen Lightning McQueen. So there's all kinds of stuff going on here, folks. I hope you like the videos. You're all coming back to watch, thanks very much. And I do appreciate the likes, the comments, the and uh, watching the whole video, that's great. And we're gonna turn this here into this. It's gonna take a while, so first thing I'm gonna do is get the pliers out and cut the um, the tow bar off the back of this thing. We don't need that anymore. There's, I got so many of these made, it doesn't matter. I can just beat a few of them up, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna fill this whole thing in with um, Play-Doh. It'll look pretty good when it's done, don't worry. I don't have to go all the way down to the bottom because the Play-Doh's gonna fill it. Off with this mirror. And I'm gonna, I can't cut that over here, so I'm gonna cover that with um, Play-Doh, make a fake roof, a uh, fake engine hood. And I'm gonna make a fake box in the back of white Play-Doh. And I'm gonna paint the whole thing primer first, and the wheels and tires will be all black, okay? So let's, um, I'm gonna get the primer paint out first and prime this whole thing, and then we'll start working on the Play-Doh, okay? Let's get the paint out. Okay, we're all set to go here, we got our primer paint. And uh, it's not going to take too much to paint Mater. This is going to be pretty cool. I can't wait to do it. The color is perfect. I never, uh, never painted the yellow car before. First, we're going to prime this thing and get it all nice and the same color. And then I'll work on the, uh, the Play-Doh part. And I'm going to paint the whole body in yellow. It's a nice yellow, but they actually has some dirt on it. See, it looks kind of just some gray swashed into it or some black. I'm going to paint that on too and uh, see if we can make a really. This is going to be really cool. I'm not going to bother doing it inside the truck because it's going to be all covered with Play-Doh. And the angels, I can't wait to do that. I'm going to cover that up with, with white. Actually, I could probably use Play-Doh yellow, but it won't matter. I'm going to cover it all the same color anyway. I've never done that before with Mater. Try to cover the hood up, make my own engine hood. I actually thought about it a few times, but never did it. It's going to take me quite a bit of paint. That's okay, though. This is nice paint. This is a great primer paint. It's just plain old gray stuff I get at the dollar store. I'll show you the brand, but somebody asks me all the time, so I have to show everybody. It's just American multi-surface satin paint. It's very cheap. And the brushes I got at the dollar store as well, they're already cheap too. But I'm gonna cover Mater up too. There's not that much of a smile on this guy. Look. Yeah, he doesn't have much of a smile on his face. We're gonna cover his teeth up with Play-Doh too. Let's see if I can get that um, that nice look on his face. Okay, let's keep on going here. Kinda got stopped there because we had a break for a sec. Okay. 
and see if I can get this first coat. I thought I'd just put one coat on of primer, of course, then I'll switch to the yellow. Now I gotta be very careful in here. His eyes on the pizza truck are almost like meters, see? So I'm gonna be, be okay with that. I just gotta cover up it along here, and everybody, I'm always very careful along here. I don't wanna make a mess of the eyes. They are perfect. Okay, came excellent, guys. Okay, now I can, I'm just gonna cover up his engine. Doesn't matter, I'm gonna put Play-Doh over that anyway. I got some yellow Play-Doh all mixed up. I know this is not a Play-Doh video, but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do to make this look right. All right? Okay, and I couldn't cut, and I, I can't cut these lights off because they're too, um, they're, this is a die cast metal car, so they don't actually come off very easily. So now I gotta be very careful. I'm gonna leave the windows. I actually, it doesn't matter, I'm painting them dark anyway. It looks like they're, they're black on the Planet Pizza trucks. I can, I can paint them black too. Okay, here goes. Don't, doesn't matter. Okay, looks good. Now this side, same thing. We're almost done with the primer. Then I can get the play doll and put it in his box. This is gonna look good, guys. This is gonna look really good. Now, a couple of people suggest the plant a pizza delivery truck, but at first I didn't want to destroy what we have, you know. But then someone said, uh, then my son said, use Mater. And I said, great, perfect idea. Okay, when this dries, then I'll put the um, Play Doh in the box and shape it. And I might put some in that hole. There used to be a mirror there. I have to cut that off too. I have to fill that up too. Okay, we're going to put the coat of paint on it. This is kind of a washed out yellow. Before doing anything else, I'm going to put some white right here. I'm going to add some yellow to it and see if I can get the right color. This is a bright yellow, so I don't know how much it's going to take. Let's stir it up, see how it looks first. It's a different color yellow altogether, actually. I don't know what to add to that. It's, kind of, it's too washed out now. Okay, put some more yellow. Let's see if I can brighten it up. Maybe put a little bit of red in there or something to change it. Or brown. Let's try a little bit of red. Actually, no, a little bit of brown, just to give it a little darkness. It's too bright. Just a little bit. Oh, might be too much. Okay, I got some paint on my arm that time. Actually, that's a little bit better, see? Little, actually, it's pretty close. Okay, good. I'm gonna start with that and see what, how that looks, first coat. Paint the whole, yeah, it's actually more of a creamy beige. It's the wrong color, but I'll put the first coat on anyway and adjust it later. This will be a good covering coat. See how that goes. Okay, how does that look? Oh boy, here we go. It's way off color, guys. Sorry about that. This is not the right color. I'll start again. Maybe I'll just go with yellow, completely yellow. But anyway, it's a good coat. Doesn't matter. I can fill it in later with something else. It's not too bad, but it's a little messy. Okay. Anyway, guys, thanks so very much again for all your comments. I appreciate it. If I keep saying the same things over and over, it's because I'm, I'm actually um, recording the video between dryness, so I forget what I said. Okay, we're almost done here. Then I can um, get the color right next coat. Okay, let's leave this dry. Well, as you can see, that's definitely the wrong color. I'm gonna try yellow and maybe a bit of black this time, see if that works. Maybe it'll just change a little bit darker. It's a bit too light for me. And maybe rather than changing it totally screwed up, it'll look more like Oh boy, it's way off. Okay, it's a little, I'll try more yellow. Maybe I can bring it up again, put too much in it. A little bit of experimentation, folks. Hey, that's better. Actually, it's not too bad. Maybe a little bit more. I'm almost there, I'm in the right hue anyway. Just gotta bring it up a little more, a little more yellow, yellow. Hey, that's not bad. Let's try a coat of that on top of the yellow. Maybe that'll be it, folks. Maybe that'll be just the right color. Very close. And just guessing at this too, I'm no expert, that's for sure, as you can probably tell. So actually, that's not too bad. Look, that's nice. Let's see if I can get this on before the furnace starts, I'll be laughing. I probably already clicked back there. I hate to stop in the middle of it. Okay. Here it goes. Keep your suggestions coming in, folks, whatever you can think of. I never would have thought of this. Somebody suggested the Planet Pizza delivery truck, and I wasn't thinking of making another made, that's for sure. I like the idea. I'll just fix this up in a few minutes with the Play Doh. And, oh, that was close. Okay, see if I can get the roof, the roof done. And, yeah, this is the right color, I think. And just drain the eyes. And don't worry about the engine because that's going to be all covered with. Oh darn! Quickly get it out of his eyes. There. There, that was close. Whew. And 
gonna cross the eyes again. Come on, Darren. Okay, you gotta be careful with this stuff, guys. I don't wanna get it. Those eyes are the best part. Okay, this is looking good. Once I fill in the hood and everything, it'll look pretty good. That looks okay, folks. Let's uh, compare them side by side. Not quite as yellow, it looks almost like black. We'll see how it looks when it dries. Okay, I mixed up another batch because I'm not happy with that color. But before I do that, I'm gonna try and stuff his engine hood with this yellow Play-Doh, see if I can remove the part where the plant of pizza delivery truck does, does have an engine hood, obviously. So I'm gonna stuff that in right here. And try and completely remove his mouth with another piece of Play-Doh. I want this to be flat in the front. I'm gonna try with a bigger piece. This is not a Play-Doh video, like I said, this is actually a car, a custom car video. So I'm just gonna try to uh, do the best I can to make it look like the plain of pizza delivery truck. So ignore the fact that we're using Play-Doh. Let me have to use the knife there. Let's see if I can shape that better. Completely cover his teeth and smooth this part off. Let's see how that looks, folks. Not too bad. I will paint the grill on that and some lights down at the bottom and some headlights, no problem. And the, his engine hood looks good, completely covered up. Now I can try another coat of paint to see how it looks. Okay, here goes. For the third try, it's almost the same color as the first one. It's a little bit more yellow. I wonder how paint's on Play Doh. Hey, it covers pretty good, look. Okay, it looks good. I'm gonna cut completely remove the fact that he has Play-Doh there. Especially the hood part. Oops. That's gonna look better than I thought, I think. Not too bad. And it does have a, a different color on it too, like some black stuff. See, it's pretty close. And then I'll, next when this dries, I'm gonna mold the back, which is the, the box on the back of the white Play-Doh and paint some windows on that and then we'll work on the, the thing on top the big projectile I'm supposed to cover that hole too I will that in a minute so I can push that right in there and cover that hole up and it's gone there used to be a mirror there we'll paint the windows on later it's not too bad folks thanks for sticking by these videos take longer than I think sometimes that this would be easy but getting the paint's been the hard part but actually with the other color coat underneath it it's coming realistically looking like the pizza truck actually because it got that dark colors in it too I'll paint the tires again too wow that looks pretty good next thing I'll do is I'll um, paint the windows on and put the car put the box in the back and paint the windows black and then we'll work on the torpedo on top leave that dry now Okay guys, this is starting to look pretty good. Coming out better than I thought. The color's almost the same. And now I'm gonna take the white Play-Doh and I'm gonna jam it in the back and I'm gonna shape it and make the box. And I don't have enough white Play-Doh. Hang on a sec. I don't think I have enough white Play-Doh, so I'm gonna jam this in here first to take up some space, some leftover yellow Play-Doh, which is a great idea. Then I'll put this on top and I'll blend it in and cut it off so it'll look like it's all white, okay? And I'll use the knife, once I get this really pressed in place good, I'll use a knife to cut it so it fits better. How's that? Let's have a look at that first. Well, I can still see the yellow, that's not good. Let's see if I can cut this down this way. Okay, that side came pretty good, and this side. That's not too bad, folks, it's getting better. And I can probably paint that the right color in the back. So I just wanna make this flatter because it is kind of sloped back. See, just shaping the Play-Doh. And then I can push this down here and cover that yellow completely like it's a big window. See, actually it's looking pretty good. And let's see, cut out a mark here where the roof actually joins it. In here. Actually not bad, see? And let's see, a little flatter. Smooth it down. You hear the dog upstairs playing with the toy. Can anybody hear that squeaking? That's the dog upstairs playing. Okay, and that's not too bad. I can probably work with that. 
Okay, now I can actually cut this off here. Okay, now listen to that crazy dog. Okay, push that down. And there's the cap on the back of the truck. Okay, just a little white play doh. Now I guess I can, um, it says yo there in the back of that. I can write that on. I'll paint the back window black, leave the, outside, the highlights white, and I'll paint the windows on black. And I'll put the black windows on here, and we'll get some black paint out right now, folks. Okay, let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. <laughs> Use the right end of the brush first. We'll paint the window on first, in black, and it's kind of sloped down towards the windshield. And the back window has sort of like an oval window right here. And a big window, hear that dog running around up there. <laughs> big window like this here. That's pretty cool. And the back is the glass window right around here. Well, this is funny. Have you ever painted, painted Play Doh before, guys? Anybody ever painted Play Doh? I know I never did, so. Here we go. I'm trying to get this close. There you go. That's not too bad. And I can write Yo. I think I might use a different brush. Pretty cool. And on this side, we're gonna do the same thing. It'll be an oval window right here. And paint this window black. I wanna put some lights on the front too, because he has lights and a bumper. And we have a big window in the back right here. Turn it around so I can see. Same idea, just a big window. Okay. Now the tires, I'm gonna do the back tires and wheels while I got it in my hands here and before I put it down to dry. Then I'll do the other two. Nice and black. This was made or I can't believe it, wow. Okay, I wonder if I can do the, the other wheels while I'm at it. Get them all done at once. Need more black paint. Okay, lots, lots of paint used in these cars, folks. You can buy that at the dollar store, like I said. And the brushes too, very cheap. There, and what's on the front? Oh, a grill, a black line for a grill. Yes, right across here. It's gonna be a bigger Planet Pizza delivery truck than we have. And I'll have to figure out how to make the rocket next. And the headlights are gray and the smile's gray and the bumper's gray. So we'll come back in a few minutes when this dries and we'll work on that. Now while that's dry, I'm gonna make the rocket. The rocket's probably the easiest thing to make. It's just a piece of Play-Doh I'm gonna mount on the top. That's too much, obviously. Um, take some off, and all it is is a, easy to make that. Just make a, a bottle play doh, shaped like a point, and I'm gonna put three fins on the back with red play doh. I'll cover right back. See, just take little strings of red play doh, stick it to the back, to the rocket, and sure enough, there's the Planet Pizza rocket. I can just squeeze them flat. And I'll mount that. Let's see how. Let's bring down Mater. See how he looks. Okay, and I'm gonna mount that right on top of the car. Everything should be dry here now. And I'm gonna do the headlights next. Let's get the gray paint, and we'll see how that looks. Okay, we'll do the bumper in gray. Both bumpers, actually. Pretty good. And it looks like his headlights are gray too. Oh, the thing just fell off. The, the thing on top just fell off. Okay, no problem. And the smile, a small smile is white, so I have a little white over here. Okay, here it is. A little white for it's kind of a, a, a small smile. There and let's see, there's kind of a black outline around his windshield. So let's see if I can do that too with a nice tiny brush here. It's gonna be hard to do. Right down to the bottom. A 
Wow, nice folks. And I maybe I can do a better job of this window. And this window. And let's see, that's okay. That looks good guys. And there's red amber, red lights down on the bumper. Hang on a second, I need some red. Okay, there's some red lights right here. And actually in the back too. I'm gonna paint red lights in the back too. Actually, I forgot to paint the bumper gray, but we'll put the red right here. And the bumper's gonna be gray. Lots of gray paint here. I should have wrote, yo, now it's too late. Maybe I can do it a little higher. Yo, well, whatever. Okay, on the side, I cannot write that, obviously, so I'm just gonna leave a little, a little bit of a white box on the side where it says Planet Pizza Delivery Truck or Pizza Planet Delivery on each side. And I'll put the uh, torpedo back on top in a few seconds. Well, this was one of the harder ones to paint because I couldn't get the paint right, folks, but look at that. There's Mater, where's the bullet gone? Oh, here it is, bullet. Where's his uh, torpedo gone? Right there. Wow, guys, there is the Pizza Planet delivery truck made out of Mater, and there's the original. What do you think? It's not the best what I did, but it sure is pretty good. Um, thanks for watching, guys, and please leave a comment. Give me more suggestions, and um, keep writing in the comments, whatever you want to say. I read, I read the comments all the time. So let's clean this up and have a look, guys. Well, there it is, folks, the Pizza Planet delivery truck from Cars 1, 2, and 3, and lots of other videos, uh, the Toy Story videos. And here is Mater, made up as the Pizza Planet delivery truck with Play-Doh on his hood, and his box is made out of Play-Doh. What do you think? Give me a comment, I think I mentioned that before. Thanks for watching, and if you have any other ideas, send them in. We really appreciate it, and have a great day, everybody.